Right, okay, um, I'm Lee. I work no, in the... No, 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 I'm not introducing you. That's what you're doing. No, I'm introducing you. <laughs> Dean, can we be on camera? Have a chat. Have a chat. <laughs> Obviously got nothing to say for himself. Yeah, and this is Lisa trying, attempting to... Smile for the camera, Lisa. Hey, look at my work. Hey everybody, here we are at Tatton Park yet again. This is our fifth year supporting Tatton Park. So, what have we got this year? Obviously we've got our RS6, we've got our RS3, and of course, we've got something special actually. We have the inch pincher. So we've brought along the MP with us. MP's the air-cooled stuff. So we have Lee, which I'll introduce you to in a minute if he's on, on here. Lee is our air cord specialist and we are looking to set up away from Awesome the website but a new air cord site for MP and some other products. So let's go and have a look at some of the cars. So as I said we have our RS38Y here. Uh, still doing some testing on that at the moment. That has the PCM box on there testing the suspension. That's got an MSS suspension kit being tested at the moment. Um, obviously has the Miltec exhaust on this and we have our 034 car this is the S4B9 this car is currently running I think it's about 560 horsepower on um, 99 fuel and we should switch this up in the next month or so running this on ethanol it's running the TTE 810 on this car and uh, we're looking to see over 700 horsepower <clears throat> Everybody will know Lisa from Awesome, and here we are with her SQ2. As you can see, that's got a VBT set up and it's got a mass of racing line products on the car. This car's been fully wrapped from Ultima Customs, who are also with us today. Over the back there, we'll have a look and see what they're doing today. Right, we also have our racing line car. So this has been stage one with us for a long time, but very recently, and we're still in testing on this car, we've gone to stage three. So look out for some draggy times coming on that. Uh, a little bit more work to do on our dyno, um, but yeah, that's gonna be exciting to see. VBT's with us as well, Bagram Technic. So they're here with their VBT car. As you can see, look, I don't know what Dean's doing in the back of the car like, but... So Dean's here, James is here with their brakes today. Anything you want to say, Dean? <laughs> Dean, can we be on camera? Have a chat. Have a chat. <laughs> Obviously got nothing to say for himself. And then, as you can see, um, this is Ryan's car from Ultimate Customs who joined us today and Ryan's wrapped his own car here and they're actually doing some wrapping on the stand if you want to have a quick look. I think Lisa's doing it, have an attempt. Yeah, and this is Lisa trying, attempting to smile for the camera, Lisa. Hey, look at my work. Right, so everybody knows this is Tabby, Simon Barnes, aka Tabby, technician. Uh, I mean, most people know him by Tabby. Pick me up on that. Uh, he didn't even pick me up on that. This, I said technician. What are you? He's the master of the universe. That's He's the master of the universe. <laughs> so this is our technical director and brought him over here to just have a quick chat about what's going on with the S4. Obviously, I've said that it's got a TT810 on it. Yeah. Uh, I said some figures earlier on, but I'm not sure. You, you, you've had it on the dyno. Tell me what it's doing. Uh, well, don't tell me. Tell them. 
So we've done obviously videos prior to this with the figures and uh, a lot of the uh, uh, draggy runs or the hour times. Um, it's making about 540 horsepower at the wheels, um, translates to about 600 horsepower at the clutch. Um, so very, very fast, very capable. That's just on 99 octane fuel at the moment. Um, I literally have sitting uh, on my desk uh, at work, uh, ethanol content sensor ready to go on. Um, we've got drums of uh, ethanol to go in and we're going to start testing the ethanol, making more power that way. And we're going to do a ethanol road. We're going to do it as it is, so yeah. road set up, road so set fast up. road set up just with And then fuel. we're going to strip everything out of the car and go to Santa Pod. Yeah, drag, drag spec. Um, we're going to drop some weight out of the car. We're going to run some smaller oh. brakes, smaller wheels, drag tyres. What's the estimated power on the ethanol? The ethanol should be over 700 horsepower. Yeah, so nice. Should uh, should be no slouch. Just need some dry weather. Yeah. yeah. Come on, England. Well, this <laughs> that's a problem. We need to move. <laughs> right. Let's relocate. Right, so as I mentioned earlier on, uh, Lee, this is Lee. Lee is uh, on our sales at Awesome, but he is also a air-cooled fanatic. So we've been working on this a long time, still working on it, but you're the reason why this is behind you and um, tell us a little bit more. Yeah, absolutely. So in the coming months, we're gonna be looking to start supplying air-cooled products um, for the older vehicles, obviously we're mainly on newer sort of vehicles at the moment, you know, Mark 5 onwards, Audi B7s onwards. Um, we want to bring in the air-cooled scene so it can expand. Um, and this is going to be a separate to Awesome. This is going to be a separate our own air-cooled site that we want to build. Essentially, yeah. So it's not going to be involved in the Awesome website itself. We're going to have our own domain name. Um, it's going to be supplying the MP products as well as other air-cooled things, service kits, belts things like that. Um, so yeah, hopefully it opens up the market for more of the Northwest, because a lot of the stuff now is made mulled down south. Yeah. Um, so especially with events like this on our doorstep, it's going to be a great thing that we can do. So he only wants to do this because he wants to trip to California, so I'm not silly. There's that as well. <laughs> and a 200 horsepower engine for my deal. <laughs> right, thank you. Yeah, no worries. Right, so that's it. That's the end of the day here at Tatton Park. As always, we have a lovely, a lovely family feel to this event. It is our local, um, so we're 15, 20 minutes from here. Um, so yeah, again, thank you all for watching the video and uh, don't forget to um, press the button and subscribe. <laughs>